Creating cinematic text animation is actually easier than it seems, and in general, any text in a video can make it more cinematic or more amateur. Therefore, in this video, we're about to show you how to make five cinematic text animations in the Movavi Video Editor Plus. My name is Arthur Weiner, this is the Movavi Vlog, and let's go! When you hear the word cinematic, you may get the feeling that you'll need some complicated professional video editing tools as well as many hours of hard work. But in fact, when we talk about cinematic, it's more about minimalism. And to create minimalism, especially with text animations, you don't need some complex tools. So let's open up the Movavi video editor and move on to the first text animation. I got this shot with T in slow-mo it looks very cool, in my opinion. And to put a text on this shot, let's move to the text section, then basic, find simple text here and drag it to the timeline. Place the text where you need, crop it as you need and double click on this text in the preview window. Let's drag it to the lower right corner, let's say here, and reduce the size of this text. In the window on the left, you can play with the settings of this text, for example, change the text itself, I'm gonna type in Movavi. You can also change the color of this text, but white suits me quite well. And let's change the font. I want something bold. Always go with a bold font or a thin one. Something in between often does not look very good. I like this black one. You want the text to stand out, so here we go. And the first animation is a strobe effect. To make it, first I'm gonna throw in a sound effect. I've downloaded this one, drag it to the timeline, and here you'll need to remember two hotkeys. The first one is just command or control plus right and left arrows. And the second is command plus B. I want this animation to end approximately here. That is, look at the audio waves and think about where you want this animation to end. Somewhere at this point, I'm gonna press command or control plus B if you're on Windows. I don't want this animation to be as long as this sound effect. I want it to start about here. Now we hold command or control and click the right arrow twice forward, command plus B, and once again twice forward, command plus B, and once again twice, and once again. Now move by clicking on the right arrow once and so on until the very end. All we need to do now is to delete the pieces in between, that is this one, then this one, then this this one and so on until the very end. And we get a strobe effect. Let's move all these forward a little bit. I want the animation to end a little bit later. Actually, I recommend starting not with the video editor, but with a platform called Movavi Unlimited. You will be able to create eye-catching content and browse for new video effects within one platform. This is where Movavi Unlimited, which is, by the way, available on the Movavi Secret Sale, may help you make your creative ideas come true. Movavi Unlimited is the unique annual plan that includes the best from Movavi in one intuitive platform. There are tools for video editing like Movavi Video Editor Plus itself, photo retouching, screen recording apps, and a set of utilities for work and study. On top of this, Movavi Unlimited gives you one year access to all the effects that the Movavi Effects Store has to offer, which means all the backgrounds, intros, filters, and of course, title templates are just within your reach. And you won't lose much time on learning. Every step of the creation process from converting raw footage to adding effects to your video project might be done in just a few clicks. Movavi Unlimited will help you create high quality content and make your ideas come true. Unlike professional software, Movavi Unlimited is accessible for many users. Its annual subscription plan includes 10 programs and a huge collection of effects at the price of just one app. And the best thing is that you won't need a top of the line computer to make the platform run smoothly. The one year subscription to Movavi Unlimited Limited is now available at 85% off on the exclusive Movavi sale. Hit the link below to use this or any other special offer from our secret page. Creating the next animation is a little more difficult, but it's worth it. Also go to the text section, find intro video, and look for new intro here. Now drag this new intro right to the timeline. Before that, don't forget to create a new video track by clicking here. Now we're gonna have something similar to the Inception movie because we're gonna place one timeline into another. 
together. Click on this little pencil, another composition will open, delete this picture, and here we need to place a text. Similarly, look for a simple text in the basic section and drag it to the timeline. Let's also type in Movavi, change the font, reduce the size, and drag it to the lower right corner. Also set the duration here, then click on the blue apply and return button and place this new composition where you want the animation to start and end. For now, nothing has changed at all. The text just appeared and disappeared at the end. I want to add a cool animation. To do this, go to the section with transitions, find the artistic section and look for glitch. Glitch always looks cool, right? I'll take the glitch free and move it to the very beginning of this text. Check this out. The appearance of the text looks cool, but for disappearance, let's go with glitch too. Drag it in the same way, but this time at the end, change the duration of the animation and here we go. To complete the effect, let's throw in two sound effects. For example, this one at the beginning and this one at the end. For the third text animation, firstly, leave the previous text in place, but remove previous animations and sound effects. This time, also go to the section with transitions, but find and another section called Offset. In general, you can experiment with other transitions, there are a lot of interesting things out there, but personally I like these ones because they're not too overloaded and minimalistic. And as the name of this video suggests, they're cinematic. Let's choose Offset 1 for the start animation, drag it to the beginning, and for the final animation, Offset 2, drag it to the end. Without any additional clicks, it turns out like this. Of course, the duration of any transition can be changed by pulling this slider, and in the same way, you can find two sound effects for them and place it at the beginning and at the end. But if these animations seem too simple to you and you want something richer, more diverse, then all this is waiting for you in the effects store. When you download a set from the effects store, elements from this set appear in the section on the left, including the section with text. For example, here, the neon section. Personally, I like everything neon. I guess you can easily tell by this sign. So let's throw in, for example, the race template. Editing the template is very easy. Click twice on it in the preview window, drag the main element first, scale it down, select both texts and drag them down. Also scale it down and place it in the middle of the element. Let's type in Movavi on top and Neon on bottom. The duration of this text is adjusted very easily right on the timeline. And of course, you can always add a sound effect to make it look even cooler. Also a cool element and in fact, very useful callouts. There is a special set with callouts. I will go with this thin line, drag it to the timeline and let's write something like a warning. The first text, be careful, on top, and the second text, it's hot, on the bottom. And we get something like this. Very cool. And if you want to find out even more about how to create and edit videos, click here. Also, smash the like button if this video was helpful to you, and see you in the next one.